David, a point gained or two points dropped? What's your thoughts? Um, I think two points dropped, going by the mood in the dressing room. Um, now look, we, we come down here, we probably expect to win the game and, and that's what we're trying to do. And Especially when we had the lead at half-time, um, you know, our aim was to keep a clean sheet and make sure we saw it out. But unfortunately we've conceded and, and not able to nick another goal. So um, yeah, a bit disappointed. When did you know you were starting? Um, just today, to be honest, the, the team was named. Obviously, we've had a lot of games in quick succession, so um, you know sometimes the, the the team is named the day before, but but not uh, for this one. And uh, just glad to get the opportunity to play. And um, you know, felt it did well in the first half. You know, set up the goal for Aiden, and we were looking good. I think at that stage, you know, it was a, it was a good first half considering the conditions. But um, you know, we weren't able to re replicate that in the second half, which is disappointing. When we spoke to Gary Miller, he said that he felt uh, you know we weren't quite at our best in the second half compared to the first. Mm -hmm. What do you think the difference was? Yeah, I'm not sure. To be honest, hard to hard to put your finger on it. Um, we probably just dropped off a little bit, which which we didn't really want to do, you know. And um, in fairness to them, they battled away and and nicked a goal. And I think we just struggled to create chances in the second half. Um, you know, I can think of one clear cut one, and, and that's really about it. So that's disappointing from our end. And um, you know, we can make all the excuses we want about the pitch, but unfortunately, you know that that won't matter when it comes to the end of the season. Now everybody's looking at the league table, so we wanted to come down and get three points, and we've not done that. So um, yeah, it's a disappointing day. As you see, a couple of chances to, to win the game, but it was it perhaps a fair result over the piece. Yeah, probably. I think um, we'd have to admit that. Yeah. Um, in the first half, maybe if we'd been able to get a second and, and uh, add on our lead when we were sort of on top and doing well, I thought um, that might have made it a more comfortable afternoon for us. But um, when you're one goal up, it's it's never comfortable. And, um, you know, they, they got their goal and, and we struggled to break them down. The lads are always disappointed whenever we lose a goal, but will they be especially disappointed at the fact that we had perhaps a couple of chances to, to clear that one? Yeah, I don't, I just, the boys are discussing whether it was on or offside. I have no idea, to be honest, from my point of view, but um, we'll have to have a look at that. But yeah, I mean, we spoke about that when you have opportunity to clear the ball and, and you don't, you're, you're asking for trouble. And um, no, look, the lads at the back have been brilliant recently. We have a great defensive record, so when you concede one, we still expect to win the game, but um, unfortunately we haven't managed to do that. At the opposite end of the pitch, a real physical battle, I thought. Yeah, especially the first half, it was a, it was, it was a bit difficult with the wind. You know, that you was holding up and you were um, just scrapping for things. And I thought that's what we did well in the first half. We scrapped really well and we we won balls that were bouncing around for the midfielders that were sort of breaking on it. We just didn't manage to do that in the second half for whatever reason. I'm sure we'll analyse it and look back. And uh, you know, we have a big game next week. We have to just try and build on what has been good form up until today. And uh, we look forward to next week's game. Important as well not to let this kind of result get to everyone too much or to dwell on it because ultimately, you know, a three point gap is still very uh, rectifiable. Yeah, of course. I mean, we still have race twice to play and we've, we've lots of games to come up. So, um, look, this was a tricky one. It hasn't gone exactly to plan, but um, as you said, we just build on it and, uh, and try and just continue what has been good form prior to now and, and, uh, and keep going. And just finally, it's uh, Hearts at the, the Falkirk Stadium next weekend. Um, a, a big game and, of course, a, a Premier League team coming to town. Yeah, it's it's a good tie for everyone to look forward to. You know, we wanted to win on Tuesday to make sure we had that. And uh, it's something that we can test ourselves against, as you said, a Premier League side. And, um, yeah, it's one to look forward to, I think. David, as always, thanks for your time. Cheers.